So, Nico Tom 23, huh? Let's see what it's all about. Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to yet another video. And today we're taking a look at Nico Tom 23. Everybody's been uh, saying a lot of good things about uh, this game, Nico Tom 23. So we're gonna take a look at it just a little bit and I'll tell you guys uh, what is going on here and, and if it is worth playing and all of that stuff so yeah let's get into it so let's just take a look at the home screen for starters we've got team of the week one and heroes classic player item so i think that's pretty much just an indicator of the latest cards here that is all it is they're trying to replicate fifa 23 um from what i can see transfer list um and we can search a market name so does this mean we have a transfer market yeah there you go ronaldo yeah we can indeed search for um players specific players on the transfer market and uh, looks like we can buy them so that is pretty cool so they are trying to replicate the fifa 23 transfer market as well i'll show you guys the nico tom champs um screen in just a bit but it's also on the play chat thing so if you can see play has draft online draft retro draft survival mode survival mode and online draft are coming soon um as you can see retro draft looks pretty cool um but yeah we I don't really get this new chemistry system, so I'm just going to change it back to the old chemistry system real quick. But yeah, the retro draft cards in general and the concept of it all um, is very interesting and looks really cool to me. Look at this old Sigurdsson card. How old is that? That is really cool if you ask me. But um, one problem I've noticed so far is way too many ads and I'm going to leave this ad in to show you guys that there's way too many ads. Um, okay, those are some angry dogs, but yeah, so far I've had about three ads already five six minutes into playing this game So yeah, um, that's not a good sign at all for me uh, But yeah, these are classic drafts uh, Let's take a look at the classic draft um, I mean not much to expect from this is there uh, really so uh, I'll not show you guys much of this right now All right, so seasons um, Apparently we have a team already um uh, yeah, we can obviously replace the player. We don't have anyone to do that right now. Oh, um, well, that's quite unfortunate. Oof. We've removed both of them from the squad. We can have Niakate in here. So we'll replace Godfrey with Niakate. Um, there you go, my squads. We can create new squads and everything. As far as the division matches are concerned, you just touch to start the match, and it's uh, like a really, really quick simulation. There's not much you need to do. I'm winning 3 0 already, 4 0. Um, yeah, it's pretty cool, but again, it's not that interactive. I uh, won 7 0 somehow against a decent uh, Leicester team. I mean, sorry, Leeds United team. So, okay, there's, there's way too many ads. Um, on this game for for real like this is too many ads and then you have cups um, It's pretty much they've tried to recreate FIFA here um, It's obviously not gonna be everything like FIFA because you, are, you obviously can't play the actual game You can't play footy um, But yeah, you can see what they've tried they've tried to do so there you go survival is coming soon apparently um, it beat the clock to get the squad to 100 chemistry all right that is pretty self-explanatory there and Nico Tom champs we've just seen right, so here's my first pack on Nico Tom 23 we've skipped it um, but yeah all right that was um, weird because I got an ad super super soon but yeah uh, looks like Nico Tom 23 you know they have the jumbo rare players pack um, kind of like FIFA premium gold pack they have a guaranteed icon player pack they have promo packs, a daily free pack, um, and look at this animation. Okay, that's quite cool. I like that animation where the rating goes up um, as the flags come out. Um, they probably will have, um, you know, um, a, a walkout animation as well. Uh, can we not? Oh, we have to quick sell duplicates. That's that's not cool that's not cool kind of i mean i think it is the most realistic considering uh, that is how it is in the um you know fifa fifa in the regular fifa game um we have sbcs that we can do to get packs as well uh pretty decent nico tom champs um we have to win drafts to rank up all right um and champs ends in sometime win a draft battle win a classic or retro draft um 
win as many drafts as possible between 5 p.m. and 9 p.m. every day to win. So we're right on time. Yeah, it's uh, just about 5 p.m. Um, pretty cool. So we could get started on that. If in prize wheel we have zero um, free spins, we need 500 Nico Tom points. Uh, which we have 550 of right now and uh, we have we will have a reward ad soon apparently and uh, Packs obviously we've seen that club you can have uh, my players. You've got SVCs, which is kind of cool um, Packs two available right now. We'll probably be able to do we have a work area as well That is quite cool Challenge requirements number of players in the squad 11. Oh, yeah, this is not happening. Is it? Um, Benrama, you can't have duplicates either, so you just have to give away players that you own. Um, which to me is, I don't know, I don't, I, it just doesn't fit in with all of the other uh, pack opener games. Um, so yeah, maybe, uh, maybe just maybe I don't like it. And there you go, I've changed that chemistry um, around again. So now let's go back into the draft. So now we're going to go back into the draft and see um, if we can uh, understand the this, this stuff a bit more. Yeah, there you go. That's that's much more like the stuff I know. Um, this is much better. Um, so Morata, uh, um, we're going to put in Brolin just because he's really high rated. Um, this, I, I would like to see the chemistry on each player. Um, I'm not quite sure how to do that just yet, but it's all right. It's all right. Um, as you can see, we can still figure out the chemistry much better than that um, old system that we had. So we'll take it, anyways. Um, can still look. Is there no way to figure out the chemistry? Um, reserves, bench. This is all quite stupid. I mean, not stupid. This is all quite. Uh, Quite the same, really. Um, we know what to expect here. We will have Musiala Hernandez, and uh, we don't get Fonzie though. Um, okay, let me just quickly complete this draft and see how this can affect our Nico Tom champs. Mm -hmm. Alright, so here's our final draft. It looks pretty decent. The classic chemistry is definitely the way to go. I mean, at least for me. And uh, yeah, as you can see, there is uh, you ca you have to click or swipe um, on the screen to check the chemistry of each player and the details of each player. Yeah, so they tried to make it really like FIFA. I've covered this already, but yeah. Um, and with the drafts, I figured out that, you know, when you uh, play the draft and you submit the draft, it just quickly sims through the draft tournament for you. Um, so we won four, all four rounds of the draft um, and we got 2056 Nico Tom coins and one guaranteed inform pack. Pretty decent rewards, to be honest. Alright, so I forgot to actually record this bit of it, but you get a free pack for following them on Instagram. Um, send all to club in the meanwhile, by the way. And you get this rare players pack, that's pretty cool. Um, so yeah, you, you definitely should follow the link when it does come up to follow them on Instagram. And uh, this is a pretty cool pack. Um, I'm just going to send all to club, nothing too special. Okay, so I've just watched an ad for a free wheel spin. Here we go. We get 500 Nico Tom points. So pretty much we've just earned an extra wheel spin. I mean, we knew wheel spins were pretty self-explanatory. We get another 500 Nico Tom points. Anyways, um, let me show you how to uh, put a player on the transfer list. I mean, it's pretty simple. You just put him onto the transfer list um, and then you go back to the home page transfer list and then you can list the item for whatever this price is. Um, and yeah, I won't do that right now. I'm just going to send him back to club. All right, so that is pretty much it for Nico Tom 23 for me for today at least um, we get an 84 rated Chiesa that's a really good pack as well I mean I personally would have liked it to be a bit more interactive they've tried to make it as much like FIFA as they can um, which I give them props for it but just again it's just not it's just it just doesn't appeal to me um, as the best of games to be honest with you uh, let me know what you think of Nico Tom 23 again I wouldn't see myself playing this day in day out although it's got really good graphics it's got um, you know really stable um, it looks like it's got really stable servers it's soon gonna have online modes it's got a retro draft but again as I said 
there's no interactive in-game uh, pack opener stuff like um, well you know foot uh, I mean Fado and all of that stuff um, for me that gives Madfoot the edge over this game so far and uh, yeah unless they added something like that I don't think I could see myself playing this day today but again if I did miss anything please do let me know in the comments down below let me know what you think about this game um, that is much more important and let me know if you'd like to see more of it and uh, yeah I'll be seeing you guys with another video real soon let me know what else you'd like to see down in the comments below and i'll be seeing you guys soon goodbye